What's up guys, Carnage here, and let's check out Hunting Simulator 2 on Xbox. This game is published by Nacon and developed by Neopica. It released on March 23rd, 2021 for a price of $49.99. So Hunting Simulator 2 came out a while back for Xbox One, but this is actually a brand new release for Series S and X. So I'm playing on the Series X version right now. Uh, I don't have a Series S, so I can't test that one out. Although I did play a little bit on Xbox One, and now I'm playing on Series X just to see the graphical differences and stuff. I, I could definitely tell there's more quality detail here. Uh, you also have more upgraded um, frame rate, faster load times, and stuff like that, as you would expect. Uh, so there is definitely uh, optimization in this version, um, standalone Series S and X version of the game. Uh, but yeah, we're going to check it out here for the first time. I didn't really play it back uh, when it came out on Xbox One. Uh, although, I, like I said, recently I've been able to check out the differences. And uh, the one cool thing I do want to mention about it, uh, as with some of the other Nacon published games, is that you get an uh, achievement list stack in this game. So uh, if you get the, all the achievements in Hunting Simulator 2 on Xbox One, well, you can get them again on the Series X and S, S version. Now, the downside with that is, of course, as this is a separate achievement list and separate version, you will have to buy this game again. There's no cross-gen bundle or anything like that, in some, uh, as with some games. So I just wanted to give you guys a heads up about that, um, you know, just to make it clear and visible. Um, you do have to buy it again if you want the uh, Series S or X version of the game. But with that aside, let's check it out. I have played a little bit of it so far. There's also a uh, $15 DLC called Ranger Mode that they just added. Um, and this is basically a new campaign. Uh, I don't have that available, but I do want to show you guys the main mode, which is Hunter Mode, and that is uh, in the base game, of course. So that's the meat of the game, literally. <laughs> we're, we're talking about animals and uh, hunting, and they drop meat. So, yes, that is the meat of the game. We're getting into bad puns right away. No, w not wasting any time. <laughs> but anyway, guys, uh, you start out in this little house here. Actually, there is a little bit of a tutorial before that. Although, um, I'm not going to replay that. It's a little boring. So, I'm going to get into more of the action in the game here. And uh, it's kind of peaceful and chill in this hub area. This is almost like the main menu. You can kind of walk around and visit uh, different parts and see more, more information. And, you know, check out uh, all the different features and options that the game has to offer here. So, companions, you unlock... Uh, yes, I, you can, by the way, indeed, pet the dog. I don't think you can do it at the moment, but I, I did it earlier in this game, and I can guarantee it works. Um, most important thing that everyone's got to know, right? Um, but we're, we are going to get to some hunting shortly, but I just want to walk around here, show you guys some of the stuff you can check out, uh, upgrade and buy weapons. I already bought a bunch of stuff, so I don't have a lot of coins left, although you do get more for as you progress through. And it's pretty open-ended, too, from what I've seen so far. Uh, you can buy upgrade. Uh, we could buy a, a scope. Let's see which one we like. Good old crosshair. Yeah, let's do that one. Uh, let's see here. Items. There's all sorts of stuff that you can get to um, definitely assist you in your hunting uh, adventure. Or you could also kind of uh, pimp out your character, I guess. Make some... Oh, wait. I don't know if they actually change gameplay stuff or it's just visual. Um, and then you have... There's other dogs as well. I don't know if there's anything aside from dogs, but hey, I don't mind. You got a dog companion with you? That's cool. Um, so let's see. We can buy more... Uh, you, yeah, first you have to buy licenses for them. Uh, otherwise, if you hunt the wrong animals, you, you don't get credit or points. Uh, but yeah, with that said, let's... Uh, Let's figure out how to get our way back outside. It's very beautiful, the environment. Um, very chill atmosphere. Like I said, it looks it looks and plays great on the Xbox Series S and X right now. Uh, obviously, I haven't played Series S version, but I assume uh, if the, the X version is obviously what I'm playing on and is, is going to be better anyway. So yeah, it's, it's solid. Uh, you can make different times of the... Uh, of the day there if you want to change the setting and let's see do we want to oh you can also okay we don't have a wardrobe yet um yeah we're just going to run out there and see uh what's going on with this here and how it goes because i uh, i'm fairly new to it 
Uh, I just only did tutorial. This is brand new to me uh, aside from the tutorial. So, yeah. Let's see if we can go upstairs first, though. Kind of want to explore a little bit. Not really much there to do, okay. But uh, yeah, let's let's start our ex our exploration, hunting expedition or whatever. Um, if we can figure out how the hell to get out of the house. <laughs> um, front door, right here. There we go. Uh, we can go to a forest or the meadows. I'm gonna go to the first area since that is probably easier. And here we go. The pa be patient, the slower you go, the quicker you can find an animal. Yeah, I am not patient, <laughs> as you guys might have already uh, figured out. We're going to see if we can uh, try to be patient and hunt some animals. Get some fresh meat and food, because we're hungry. Okay. So there's already, uh, let's see, there's already, that's a rock. That's not footprints. <laughs> uh, it's a red herring. Let's see here. We have a shotgun. We have another weapon. I'm trying to figure out. Okay, so you can press uh, up on the D-pad if you like third person rather than first person. Although I prefer first person. Left trigger is to zoom in. Or to, uh, well, that weapon doesn't have a zoom. But where the hell is that crosshair I bought? Maybe I had a switch gun? I don't know. Hopefully we have more ammo too than, yeah, 12. But we'll see how it goes here. Like I said, first time playing, and uh, aside from tutorial, which I did play a couple days ago because I had uh, had some stuff I had to take care of. Didn't get a chance to upload this as soon as I could. Uh, so sorry about that, guys. But hope you guys enjoy the game regardless uh, and the video nevertheless. Um, let's see here. I, I do like the lighting and effects and everything. But yeah, I think this uh, is really open-ended in this game. I don't know if there's actually like a whole storyline and objectives to follow or or what, because I'm not sure where to go yet. <laughs> um, just going to try to set a waypoint. Let's see, we can set a waypoint to... Oh, interesting. Let's, let's hunt some cougars. And I don't mean those kind of cougars, because <laughs> if you want to find those cougars, you got to go to a bar. <laughs> um... Wait. Oh, that's not where they are. That's just marking if you think they're there? I'm not sure. I'm going to mark the uh, waypoint here, though. And we'll see what happens. Hopefully, uh, our goal will be to at least hunt one animal in this uh, expedition. I really hope we can figure out what we're doing here. I'm just a hunting noob. I, I haven't played a lot of hunting games, to be fair. Uh, but it is, it is kind of unique. And um, there's not too many of them, so it's it's cool to check that something different out. You know, I obviously like to try all different types of games on my channel on Xbox. So um, I'll I'll play almost anything, guys. And there's a lot of uh, a lot of people that are big fans of these kind of hunting games. Um, so looking forward to trying to get into it. Although, yeah, it's not going to be easy to find any anything here. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe maybe that's something. Got ducks over there, I think. <clears throat> but in a way, I, I unless I'm missing something, I do wish there were more like story objectives of what to do. Um, it's not really guiding you. We're going to go up in this tower and hope we don't... Oh, there's the duck right there. Let's try sneaking up here. Wait, what did I do? Did I not get up there? Oh, it automatically makes you go up there. Okay. All right. Now that we scared all the ducks away. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't see them anymore. What the hell? Oh. There's something down there. Hmm. Let's see if we, uh, if we take a look at the achievements, by the way. Um, all I did so far was spot your first animal. I did not actually claim the first animal, apparently. Um, there's also ones for 
purchasing all weapons, all gear, stuff like that. I'm not going to look through everything, um, analyze tracks. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of achievements, though, a lot to do. Get shots from, uh, get uh, sniper shots, I guess. Get a, land a killing shot from a stand. Uh, ooh, that, I am in a stand right now. I could try that. But yeah, I'm not going to bore you guys with all of the, uh, looking at all the achievements. Uh, we're going to try to actually get some, get some animals here. Wrong caliber. What the hell does that mean? Um, how do I switch caliber? Let's see. We got to figure this stuff out. Control. Is there a control um, menu? Like, there's no information about what the controls are? Interface, maybe. Huh. Definitely a lot of options. I will say that much. Controller bindings. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. So we got to take a second to figure this stuff out here. Crouch prone, right? Okay. Call of Duty style, right? Um, well, actually, no, not really. But anyway, um, reload, interact, switch weapon. How do I switch caliber? I don't understand that. Um, unless it's not with this weapon at all, and I can't do it. Yeah, it's probably not going to work. Yeah, that'll be wrong, I think. <laughs> um... What if I do it anyway? What the hell? Let's do it anyway. Uh-oh. Yep. Not gonna happen. Not sure if I was supposed to do that. Probably not. <laughs> uh, let's exit this tower, though. Because we're not getting anywhere with that. Hopefully we can make some progress here. See if we could find a animal track, animal tracks or whatever. They will, they will let you know and like notify you with little on-screen HUD stuff, like I remember from tutorial. So we're just gonna have to be a little patient. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I wish there was a laid-out uh, information of like what to do exactly, like what objectives. I don't want it just all like all open-ended. Um, I need some guidance in this type of game. Uh, so, you know, that's one slight downside. Unless I'm obviously missing something. Could be. Could very well be. But I am enjoying the environment and stuff. Very nice to look at, so don't mind running around here. Let's see. Oh, there's the ducks. They, they went away here. Get a long shot, even if it's the wrong thing. Should I do it? I'm going to do it. Unethical hunt. <laughs> wrong caliber used. Oh, man, I lost 250 bucks for that. <laughs> oh, well. Didn't even get an achievement for it. The hell with that. Um, man, it's dark over here, and it's even the daytime. We gotta find some real animals. Come on. Well, not real animals because it's a game. But you know what I mean. More than some damn ducks laying in the water. <laughs> um, can we climb up here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's see. We got a good view from here. We could run with the left stick as well. Hopefully we'll find something. Oh, okay. Well, something just popped up over there. I saw that. We are going to make our way up here. I do uh, wish that there was no stamina uh, limit, but then again, I guess this is a simulator after all, so it's trying to be realistic so whatever <laughs> just gotta be patient oh 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 that is not patient I just scared the hell out of the animal away and now I can't get it damn it <laughs> it doesn't look like we can get that one anymore 
Rip. Mm, let's see. We'll try again still, but I feel like it's gotten away at this point. Can we see any tracks? Oh, wait a minute. Aha. There we go. Okay. Oh, we analyzed a uh, track. So it's that way. So maybe we still have a chance. Um, those are flowers. Those are not the track. What happened to the track? Okay, it's that way. That away. Got to really slow down here, though. Aha! I think I saw it. Or I could be seeing things. Yeah, and it's not. Although, this looks like... Ah, oh, I thought it was paw prints, but it's a, uh, it's a rock. <laughs> uh, we're gonna sneak, um, with the right stick here. Try to be careful and stealthily ambush them. Okay, it's not there. Every time I think I... Nope, that's not it. That looks like the way it would have went, though. We're going to try going this way. Hopefully that is the right direction. Oh, yep, yep, yep. All right, we're getting somewhere now, guys. Hopefully. we got to be really patient. Hopefully it's the right uh, caliber thing as well. Let's see here. We are going to try to sneak. Is that it right there? No, not quite. Man, you move really slow when you're crouched. Like, I wish it was a little bit faster. Um, but this is definitely a marking here. A moose footprint. Alright, we're going to slowly walk over here. I'm going to be patient this time. Definitely need patience in this game. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to run a little bit, but I don't want to mess it up. I don't know if they give you, like, a meter of how close they are. But I'm in the uh, bushes here, so hopefully they don't see me. I don't know which way he went from here, though. Damn. I really wish I had a uh, sniper zoom on this gun, but it doesn't look like it. Let's see, is that another? No, that is not. Man, it's... Oh, 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 wait. No, that's a butterfly. Um... It's like, where the hell would this moose be hiding? If I was a moose, where would I hide? Um, I think behind that rock, but it's not quite. Where the hell is he? I'm going to try going up this way. At this point, I'm like already losing patience, but we are going to run up here and hope we don't scare it away. Watch it come up behind me and, like, try to kill me. That would be funny if that happens in this game. I don't know if it does. Um, I feel like I'm going the wrong way. Like, there's so many ways it could have went now. <laughs> oh, man. Damn. That does not look good. Nope. It's not that way. He can't go in the river. Um. Hmm. At least I don't think so. It's very hard to see. Might have to turn the brightness up a little bit. Uh, at least my TV is kind of making this hard to see it. Um. Can we go in the water? Okay, cool. We can go around. 
Let's see, what's on the map here? Wow, we are far off the beaten path. <laughs> Looks like there's a lot of area, though. I'm going to show you guys uh, how far you can go and zoom out. Pretty big map. Oh, wait a minute. Was that? I could have sworn I saw something there. Damn. But it doesn't look like it. Interesting, though. We are going to keep searching. Maybe I will be able to hunt one animal this whole time. I will be satisfied with that, to be honest. Um, hopefully you guys will do a better job at this than I am. <laughs> uh, also, not falling down the hill there. Hopefully not. Oh, can I shoot them? I doubt it, though. I don't want to waste my bullets. I wonder what happens if you run out of bullets, if you can get more at a... Uh, or if you go all the way back, or... Maybe it will just let you check in your menu. I'm not sure. Still learning. Let's see. Oh, wait a minute. I can never tell if that was flowers or footprints. No, dandelions, I think. <laughs> Damn. Damn, D-Lions. <laughs> All right. Ooh, that's a nice view, though. Like I said, this game, uh, I don't feel so bored because I'm, even though I'm not finding the animal, I'm still enjoying the scenic route here. <laughs> very nice uh, water effects. Wow, that looks very lifelike, especially on Series X. I mean, I, I just don't know the best way to find these animals still. So we're just going to wander around. Like I said, I am not the most experienced uh, hunting player in this game or whatever. Or uh, hunting games. I haven't played a lot of them. Although I do appreciate the uh, different type of experience it is for a game. Let's see. I'm not going to give up, though, yet. Not just yet, at least. We are going to give it our good go. Okay, let's see where we can go from here. <clears throat> okay, so that way... Hmm... But yeah, like I said, I do wish there was more uh, instruction on where to go. Uh, it's kind of just open-ended at this point, I think. And I don't know if that's a full... That's actually a campaign, then. I wouldn't call it even story. I'd just call it... It's it's a hunting simulator. You know, you get in there, you do what you want to do. Um, at least to my knowledge. Like, I haven't found anything that explains otherwise. So, uh, like I said, I, the tutorial was the part where it did a little of that, but then I already beat the tutorial, and it just puts you in. And now I have no idea <laughs> where the hell to go. Or what to do. Like, how to find an animal successfully. Um, I mean, the tutorial kind of tells you, but... Yeah, it's uh, not easy. Now, we could go back to the cabin and see if we can... Um, yeah, let's... Actually, um, we won't go back there just yet. I'm going to try with this weapon. But I feel like there's, uh, the more weapons you buy, obviously, you know, you can have more options for different animals. Because if you, you can't shoot them with the wrong animal, with the wrong gun or wrong caliber, stuff like that. But yeah, if, if you guys want a game where you're just, um, it's, it's obviously it's a simulator. It's very close to the real hunting experience. And, uh, you know, if you live in a city and there's no hunting, like where, you, where I live in New York, it's, uh, you know, you definitely want to, um, maybe upstate New York actually has hunting and stuff like that. 
But you know what I mean. <laughs> if you want to hunt and you don't have an area, you can hunt in this game and play. And it's fairly close to, uh, I guess, real hunting? I don't know. I, I haven't uh, really hunted much in real life, so I wouldn't know. But I'm guessing. So, yeah. Anyway. Doesn't look like I'm getting anywhere here um, at the moment. So, I'm not going to lie. I am getting a little frustrated. Uh, I do see an animal there that popped up. Oh, and another one there. So, maybe we'll try that. Let's still give it a try. Um, I'm worried if I can't hit it from here, though. Where the hell was that? I thought I saw something here. Let's see. If we get closer... Um, but yeah, this game is not definitely not for everyone. It's a very niche game, so you know what you <laughs> if you if you're if you like hunting and hunting simulators, then you know what you're getting into right away with this one. Uh, ooh, let's try it. Oh, it's a wrong caliber. Damn it! I really, really don't know what this weapon is good for then. Ah, uh, that sucks. Wrong caliber, so we can't. We can't do that. There's also a different skill um, things in the HUD there that you can upgrade, maybe? Not too sure. Uh, but let's see if that other animal here can be uh, can be claimed from this weapon. Yeah, that's kind of a bummer. They should tell you um, exactly what, what you can and can't. That looks like another duck, so it doesn't look like we're going to be able to... Uh, but yeah, like I said, this game is not going to be for everyone, obviously. Uh, if you know what you're getting into, if you play a hunting game, uh, it's as it sounds. It's a simulator. So, yeah. For me, I figured I would I would want to try it out anyway, just to see. Uh, and I'm glad I did. It's still, it's still a unique um, type of game. It's just... Might not be... <laughs> this one might not be for me, personally. Um, or at least... You know, maybe later on once I figure out stuff and learn more about it. But like I said, this is just my initial experience doing the tutorial and then just starting out. And uh, this is what a new player will experience. So um, hopefully you guys are doing better, <laughs> will do better than, than I do at it. And maybe it'll click with you guys. So I'm not saying it's a, uh, definitely not saying it's a bad game. It's just not for everybody is what I'm trying to say. Uh, you got to be patient. And that's something that, Sometimes I am not patient. <laughs> um, we're going to go back that way, though. But I'm going to give it a little bit of a... A little more of a college try here. <laughs> like I said, though, the graphics are beautiful. The uh, atmosphere, the, the ambiance, very nice. Especially on Series X. Uh, good quality. You know, if you had it on Xbox One already, you probably want to pick up this. If you enjoyed the, the game, then... You want to probably pick up the new version of it. Um, which I will leave a link to the store page um, in my video description. So that way you guys can check it out as well. Let's see if we can sneak up on this animal. I saw it for like a split second. At least the notification of it. But... Not anymore. Huh. Oh, wait a minute. There it is. Ooh, what animal is that? Curious now. Oh, that, that threw me off again. Oh, man. This animal is heading off in the uh, opposite direction, I think. It's making my life a little more challenging here. It's like hard enough already. Come on, give me a break, animal. Um, oh, was that it? Can't tell. Oh, man, we're getting close, I think. I feel like it's this way. I hope. I really hope. Oh, it went really far again. Damn, this thing is running away. We're going to have to make our way up here quick. As 
This almost reminds me of a battle royale, just running around aimlessly until you find some action. Yeah, that's what, that's what we need, a hunting simulator battle royale game. Just kidding. Maybe. <laughs> um, is it up this hill? Damn, this thing is like running a marathon. It is not stopping. Come on, dude. Where do you go? Can't even keep up with it. It's got to be up this hill. Aha! Here we go. Uh, that's that moose again. Although I don't know if we'll be able to... hunt that one with this gun. But we're going to try getting over there anyway. Making our way, hopefully. If he doesn't stop slowing down. Yeah, like I said, this is uh this is not easy just tracking one animal even. Okay, where the hell did he go now? Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm I don't think I'm gonna keep up with this animal here. <laughs> it's ridiculous. They are uh they are far away already. We might have to go a different route and hope we find something different or meet up with him another another way. Hmm. I'm going to try to be a little persistent, but like I said, no, not going to lie, I am uh, getting a little burnt out and frustrated on this. Um, seeing as uh, this animal keeps running away and I can't catch up with it. Um, all I want is to hunt one animal. That's all we need for now to be satisfied. But I don't even think that's going to happen, to be honest, guys. Uh, not going to lie. Hate to say it, but uh, I think that's going to be it for now, guys. Um, yeah, he's far away. This, uh, there's no other animals in sight. Uh, this is the kind of game you do want if you want to kind of just take things casually and relax and take your time and be patient about finding the animals and hunting. Uh, any hunting enthusiast, I would definitely recommend this game for them. But uh, for anyone else that's not really keen on hunting, I don't know why you... Uh, you want to check this one out in the first place, to be honest. But uh, for me, it was personally, I like to try all different types of games and uh, show you guys a little bit of them and give my impressions on it. And I was, you know, being totally honest and blunt about my, you know, um, about my, how I like the game or what I think of it. And honestly, it's not exactly for me, uh, but I'm not saying it's a bad game. It does seem solid and they put a lot of work into it. It's just, um, it starts off slow and, you know, it doesn't really guide you well. Uh, they need more. They need more polish on that part, I would say. Um, but otherwise, I do appreciate. Um, I do appreciate the PR company and publisher providing me the review code so that I was able to showcase this game for you guys. Hope you enjoyed the uh, video. If you did, leave a like. Hope it helps you guys decide if you want to check out this game for yourself. Like I said, it might vary. Everyone's opinion, you know, is welcome. Uh, if you guys want to post in the comments, let me know what you thought of it. If you enjoy this game, if you. Uh, if you're not keen on hunting games or anything like that, uh, or if you, you know, checked it out, even gave it a try, and maybe you turned out to like it. Uh, curious to know what you guys think, so post in the comments if you want, and uh, feel free to subscribe for more content. I have a lot more stuff on the way of other games as well. And thanks again uh, for checking it out. See you guys next time.